Garfield cartoon here. So Garfield, something happening in frame two. Garfield maybe scheming for John's drink. Smack, Garfield wants to play. Leave me alone, Garfield. Let's play, let's play. John's like, oh, okay, we'll play. Tickle, tickle, tickle. Ha ha, he he, hoo, hoo. Okay. <laughs> and then Garfield bites John. Ouch, I'm through playing now. So Garfield's done playing. Okay, yeah, so, so funny. So when the cats want to play, we must play with them. But when they're done playing, like, yeah, it's, it's done. Stopping cats. Ah, so funny. In this cartoon, the man's name is John and the cat is Garfield. So refer to frame two. How is John's body language different to that of Garfield's state two points? Um, so in frame two, as you can see here, John's eyes are half closed and Garfield's eyes are wide open. Maybe John is a bit tired. They just woke up in the morning. John is sitting while Garfield is jumping up and down. That was 4.1. Uh, 4.2, explain how the cartoonist conveys the idea that Garfield is bothering John in frame three. Uh, stay to visual clues specifically. So in frame three, we've got it here. The movement lines that show Garfield, shows Garfield hitting John with his paw. Uh, the word smack, that's in bold. It emphasizes that Garfield has startled John. The liquid in John's cup is spilling over because Garfield has pushed him. Uh, John is leaning forward, indicating that he's also been, uh, he's been pushed. 4.3, rewrite the underlined contraction in full. Uh, so will, that's gonna be we will. 4.4, refer to frame seven. So here's uh, frame seven. Explain how John's actions convey that he is in pain. Refer to one verbal and one visual clue in your answer. That's gonna be coming from frame seven. So verbal, uh, he shouts, ouch, ouch. And that ouch is written in bold as an exclamation mark. Visual, his mouth is really, really wide open. Uh, the movement lies behind his head and back. Um, and that indicates that he tilts his head in sudden pain. John spreads out his fingers in pain. And one verbal and one visual clue uh, must be mentioned here. Guys, it must be one verbal and one visual. That's what the question is asking you. Okay, don't give me two verbal or two visual. Study the following sentence. I'm through. I'm through playing now. That's 4.5. Uh, we need to provide a homonym here. So a homonym is like the word is spelled exactly the same, but it just has a different meaning versus a homophone being pronounced the same, but being spelled differently. So through, I'm through playing now. Like I'm done playing now versus um, I looked like through the window to see what was outside. 4.6, do you sympathize with John in this cartoon? Discuss your view. Again, this is a yes and no answer. And as your, your online tutor must go through both ways. So yes, uh, John is replying. Sorry, sorry. John is enjoying his beverage. John is enjoying his beverage when Garfield startles him. And Garfield pesters John until he plays with him. They both appear to be enjoying the game and Garfield eventually bites John to end the game. And John does not deserve to be bitten. So that's a yes answer. And no answer, no, John tickles Garfield. However, Garfield does not like being tickled for too long. And John should have been more careful when playing with an animal as cats are aggressive and unpredictable. So no is like a very Karen kind of answer. <laughs> so yeah, look, whatever you said, uh, it's probably not gonna be wrong unless you substantiate it incorrectly. So yeah, just back up all your opinions and you should be fine.